as you may know, I work part-time at retail, and on my way home for work one day, just as I'm about to nod off for a little bit of a nap on the bus ride, I came up with an image in my mind of a brown bird. For the last couple of days, I had been thinking of doing my next bird painting, so I let myself go with the, the flow of, I guess you could call, my dream brown bird. And this design is what I came up with. I hope you enjoy it. I'm using paint pens for the bird, but with a little bit of adjustments and tweaking. You can also use uh, regular acrylic paints, gouache, and even watercolor. This brown bird rock painting has been sped up a lot. All told, it probably took about maybe 45 minutes to an hour, not including time spent between layers of paint drying. So take your time as you do it. No reason to rush it. Just take your time. So grab your rock or a canvas if you want to do it on a canvas. Get your art supplies together and paint along with me. If you need to stop and pause and rewind, go ahead and do that too. Just have fun. Sometimes I'll bring in a rock painting and to get you know, some opinions from people I work with. But as I was showing it to a few people, a question popped into my mind. Now, I could just keep calling it my brown bird rock painting, but that seemed kind of impersonal. So I asked three people, what they would name the bird. They looked at me as though I was crazy. If you had a brown bird, what would you name him or her? I asked each one independently so that they're not influenced by hearing somebody else's name. And although I'm sure of two names, Unique and Bubble, And although I'm sure that the other one was Buckley, I'm not exactly sure sure. I had written names on a piece of paper, folded it, and put it into my pocket, thinking that between then and when I recorded the voiceover for this, the chances of me actually losing it were pretty slim. Well, 
I lost it. I do that a lot more often than you would think. And in my defense, however, there was a great comedian named George Carlin. I don't remember the name of the skit, but it was basically around the place where lost things appear. So eventually, I'll be able to find the list, and maybe my mind along with it, along with all the other things that I've lost over the years, which is a, quite a lot. If you had a brown bird as a pet, what name would you give him or her? Select it between one of the three names that I gave you earlier. Unique, Bubble, or Buckley. And leave a comment down below as far as your choice. The reason why I'm doing this is as a massage therapist, every Thanksgiving and Christmas Eve and day for a number of years, I would volunteer massages at the Ronald McDonald House in Chicago. Since I no longer do that, what I'm planning on doing is getting together a number of stones and donate them to the Ronald McDonald House for around Christmas. I'm going to need to do about 50. So for this one, what I'll do is I'll write the name on the back of the stone and include it with the others that I'm, I'm going to be donating. I hope you'll help me out with this. Thank you in advance. Subscribe for more rock painting ideas and hit the like button if you like the video. Thanks a lot. Celebrate each other. Celebrate your own creative inner voice and remember to paint along the way.